with us tonight. I'm Dick Dorwald. On the show tonight, Doris Davies, a prominent high desert citizen, was named the Contel Senior Humanitarian of our community. Wonderful lady. You'll meet her tonight if you don't know her already. Larry Hunt will be here, a very fine wildlife artist. He's 23 years old, but he's going to be great, and you'll enjoy looking at some of his work, I'm sure. Those who are knowledgeable about the graphic arts in the high desert have really been excited recently by the emergence of a fine, young, 23-year-old artist. And Larry Hunt's a kind of a... You're kind of a neighbor, Larry, because your work is displayed at uh, one of the neighboring suites here on the 36th floor of uh, Tower Center here in the penthouse. And uh, uh, I... I discovered you because I went over to your one-man show there. Was the show successful at Gallery West? It went very well, yes. I sold ten pieces, so that was good. Anytime an artist sells ten pieces, it's just wonderful. Because we all know about starving artists, right? Yeah, yeah, I know a lot about starving. <laughs> Interesting is that at 23 years old, your work shows a remarkable maturity, and I'm going to show you some of his work in just a little bit. I have it here. How do you account for that? Is it your love these critters? Your, your, he majors in wildlife uh, reproductions. I, how do you account for the amazing maturity? Um, I don't know. It's just trial and error. I just keep working at it, and every time I make a mistake, I make sure not to make that mistake next time. And I study a lot of artists' work and look to see how they do things. And I kind of just work from there. It just comes naturally. Who is your idol as far as wildlife is concerned? Well, I enjoy Robert Bateman's wildlife. He's good. You're good. If you try to... Of course, you have your own style. Your style is nothing like his. But uh, you show a remarkable maturity in your work. It's just amazing to me. How'd you... You're 23. How'd you happen to get started? Well, I... Uh, I've been drawing all my life, scribbling and so forth. You know, in high school, I used to draw pictures of the teachers and cartoons. But it wasn't until about two years ago that I started taking it seriously. And I had a friend that, uh, or I have a friend that's into art, and he knows a lot of people that enjoy art. And uh, he's helped me out quite a bit. And so that's, that's how it started. And he just keeps encouraging me to do more. All right. I can tell you this, folks. This young man is going to be one of the wildlife artists in the country. Now, you can just put that down, that you heard that on, what is this, the 14th? The 14th of June, 1989. You heard that here first. And here's what I mean. Let me show you the picture of the bald eagle. Look at that. Isn't that remarkable? Look at that detail. Larry, tell us about this one. Well, that's a bald eagle. I said that and, already. Uh, it's <laughs> a lot of detail. Um, I don't know what to say. It's a colored pencil piece. Uh, on black, uh, matte board. Hurry up, my arms are getting tired. Okay, and uh, it's just the contrast there of the blacks and the whites really make it stand out. It's just a very nice piece. Uh, what did you use for a model on this? Um, I used fo a photograph. Photograph of a bald eagle? Yeah. It's just marvelous. Thank you. And uh, you do uh, portraits, uh, rarely, but here's one of your portraits. Let's put this on the other camera here. Let's get this on the other camera. This is uh, one of your portraits. Uh, who is this, by the way? Well, the picture was taken from uh, a picture of Sybil Shepherd, but I wasn't trying to make it look like her, so I didn't really work on the face that much. But So it's just a woman. That's just what I wanted. Was hey, and what's woman. the medium here? Uh, that's colored pencil and acrylic paint. And if I, if I might add, I tried to do this. Uh, another one of my uh, artists that I like is... Uh, a man named Drew Struzan, and he does uh, advertising for the movies. And that's kind of what that style is. I kind of uh, kind of picked up a little bit from him. Okay, terrific. Now, another critter picture here. I want you to look at this. Isn't this marvelous? Tell us about this one, Larry. Well, that's a blue jay, and that's colored pencil and also acrylic. I like to grade the background like that. Uh, on quite a bit of my pieces, I've done that, and that isn't that very time-consuming to do that. A, a bit, yeah, because I have to mask off the bird and then airbrush that. But it, it's well, well worth it. Comes it's, it's a, it's a very 
interesting look when it's uh, the color is uh, shaded like that marvelous blue jay I'm going to tell you in a minute where we can where you can buy Larry's pictures just be patient it's a bighorn sheep right uh-huh mm -hmm. that's called chocolate covered bighorn that's the title of it and again the medium is the same uh, uh, yeah color colored pencil, pencil with acrylic now sometimes I airbrush acrylic and sometimes I uh, just brush it with a brush that right there I, I brushed on very nice so see I wasn't kidding you was I the guy is great at 23 years old and you're getting better all the time uh, what are you gonna do with all your money when you get famous rich and famous I don't know I buy more I paint cross that bridge when I come to it <laughs> buy more paint and yeah. artist supplies I suppose we have some people out there who I know <clears throat> would like you to do a portrait they'd like to buy one of your pieces a lot of people are into wildlife uh, in fact isn't there a kind of a resurgence of interest in wildlife pictures paintings these days it seems it seems to be so yeah mine seem to be going with the well. ecology thing you know and the and the endangered species and this kind of thing I think that's part of the reason for the resurgence probably okay how can people get your paintings or get in touch with you about a commission well, um, I'm, I sell my pictures exclusively through Gallery West in Apple Valley. Uh, so they, they can get your paintings or contact you exclusively at Gallery West in Apple, in, Valley. In Apple Valley. And uh, we'll zap the phone number on the screen, and uh, I feel sure there's some people who want to be in touch with you. I hope so. Larry, thank you very much for being with us. Lots well, of luck on your you. upcoming career. You're going to be great, I'm telling you. Don't you agree? And action! Hot.